Delta State, in South-South region of the Federation, is blessed with abundant human resources and a major oil-producing state. In order to maximize these resources and potentials, Governor Ifan Yokoa has made conscious efforts to improve infrastructure development, encapsulated in his five-point agenda themed SMART, which is aimed at creating wealth. For Governor Okowa, road accessibility is one critical area to focus on. The administration has also made its impact felt in the riverine communities with the construction of Ogei floating market awaiting commissioning. When we came last, they had told me they would try to finish in February and I put a lot of pressure and insisted that we wanted it completed this year. Uh, the information I have is that they are still working very hard to ensure that they will finish the project at the middle of December. And from what we can see, the superstructure for the uh, bridge is already on and a lot of work is being done and by October we expect that this would have finished completely and the ancillary work uh, to provide the full interchange with the road network under uh, will also be started in due course. Delta Leisure Park and Film Village in the tourism sector has witnessed a facelift. Governor Okowa enumerates plans to turn Delta State into a movie and entertainment hub in Nigeria. Bridging finance is, uh, is actually a finance that uh, we already have a source of payment and uh, rather than allow the depreciation of the Naira or the extension of time at work to have uh, create a cost escalation for us, our intention was to uh, uh, take uh, a bridging finance and then pay back from the monies that the federal government owes us. So far, According to the Ministry of Works, over 880 road projects comprising 1,811 kilometers of road, 997 kilometers of drains, and 22 bridges in urban and rural areas of the state have been recorded, with more still underway.